Everyone loves the look, smell, and feel of a new car starting from an early age. But actually buying a new car comes down to price. The global parts supply chain crosses borders many times. At what point does a tariff or a tax stop being imposed on the parts? Larry Carl is CEO of the Automobile Dealers Association of Kansas City. He says while the famous Ford F-150 is made in Kansas City, some of its parts come from outside the U.S. There is conversation in Washington about a border adjustment tax that could have significant impact on consumers ranging from anywhere from $1,900 to $2,200 per car. With the average new car transaction just above $30,000, an additional two grand can push some people out of the new car market. In Washington, everything is a concern and everything tends to fizzle out depending on who's doing the spin. This is an important element that affects our country and our economy in a very significant way. A potentially dramatic change. For now, he and others are focused on this week's auto show. We have 500 cars and trucks spread out over 300,000 square feet. If you can't find a car here, you're not looking too hard.